Hey there, let's play the country for January 8th. Yesterday's country was Andorra. The Principality of Andorra is a sovereign landlocked microstate in the Eastern Pyrenees, bordered by France and Spain. Its population is 77,000 and its capital is Andorra La Vella. Fun fact, Andorra La Vella is the highest in elevation capital city in Europe. <laughs> A prehistoric seasonal hunting camp was found in what is now Andorra, dating back at least 11,000 years. Roman influence is recorded from the 2nd century BCE to the 5th century CE. After the fall of the Roman Empire, Andorra came under the influence of the Visigoths. Andorra was sheltered from the Muslim Empire of Andalus by the Franks. Tradition holds that Charlemagne granted a charter to the Andorran people for a contingent of 5,000 soldiers. In 988 CE, Count Borel II of Urgell gave the Andorran valleys to the Diocese of Urgell in exchange for land in Cerdanya. Since then, the Bishop of Urgell has been co-prince of Andorra. The first document that mentions Andorra is from 839 CE. In 1278, the King of Aragon, Peter III, mediated an agreement providing that Andorra's sovereignty be shared between the Count of Foix, whose title would ultimately transfer to the French head of state, and the Bishop of Urgell in Catalonia. In 1607, Henry III of Navarre issued an edict that established the head of the French state and the Bishop of Urgell as co-princes of Andorra, a political arrangement that still holds today. Conflicts arose throughout the 19th century, and in 1933, France occupied Andorra following social unrest. On July 6, 1934, adventurer Boris Skosirev proclaimed himself the sovereign of Andorra, and on the 8th, he issued a proclamation declaring himself Boris I, King of Andorra. He was arrested by the co-prince on July 20th and ultimately expelled from Spain. A French military detachment was garrisoned in Andorra from 1936 to 1940 to protect it against the Spanish Civil War. Many refugees from both sides of the Civil War settled in Andorra. Andorra remained neutral during World War II and was an important smuggling route between Vichy France and Francoist Spain, though many Andorran citizens criticized its government for their fascist sympathies. Andorra experienced a capitalist boom beginning in the 1930s, attracting mass tourism, and a professional banking sector. The political system was modernized in 1993 in which a constitution was drafted by the co-princes and the general council. That year, Andorra became a member of the UN and the Council of Europe. In 2006, Andorra formalized a monetary agreement with the EU to use and mint the euro, though it is not actually a member of the EU. Andorra is a parliamentary co-principality with the Bishop of Orgel, currently Joan-Henrique Vives e Sicilia, and the President of France, currently Emmanuel Macron, as its co-princes. The politics of Andorra take place in a framework of a parliamentary representative democracy with a unicameral legislature and a multi-party system. Its current prime minister is Xavier Espot Zamora. Andorra consists predominantly of rugged mountains. Its highest point is Coma Pedrosa at 2,942 meters, or 9,652 feet, and its average elevation is 1,996 meters, or 6,549 feet. Andorra has alpine, continental, and oceanic climates depending on elevation, summers are generally mild, and winters are snowy. Tourism accounts for roughly 80% of Andorra's GDP. An estimated 10.2 million tourists visit annually, attracted by Andorra's duty-free status and its summer and winter resorts. Ethnic Andorans are a romance group of Catalan descent. Two-thirds of Andorran residents lack Andorran nationality and do not have the right to vote. The official language of Andorra is Catalan. Spanish, Portuguese, and French are commonly spoken. The population is predominantly Catholic. Compulsory free education is provided by the government for children ages 6 to 16. There are three systems of schools, Andorran, French, and Spanish, which use Catalan, French, and Spanish respectively in instruction. Parents may choose which system their children attend. Andorra ranks 40th on the Human Development Index and 25th in nominal GDP per capita. Andorra has one of the highest life expectancies in the world at about 83 years. The infant mortality rate is 2.4 deaths per 1,000 live births. The literacy rate is 100%. Andorra is ranked 53rd on the Press Freedom Index and is rated free by Freedom House. So, been around a long time. I thought that was super interesting. Also, it amuses me greatly that the president of France is a co-prince of Andorra as well. So, we will start in Andorra and go where the winds take us. Oh, we're staying in Europe, heading east. Well, a larger country and warmer isn't extremely surprising. Uh, it rules out the Nordic countries <laughs> for temperature. Uh, okay, east. Gosh, uh, that could be almost anything. Let's go to Italy, if I can type. 
Okay, northeast of Italy, smaller and cooler. Okay. It's actually a pretty limited temperature range right there. Uh... How about, um, Bulgaria? I don't know. Okay. Smaller than Bulgaria to its northeast. Um, where does that put us? How about Moldova? <laughs> I always try Moldova now. Oh, it is Moldova! Look at that! Well, I'm glad I tried it. Cool. So we'll learn about more. We'll learn. We'll, we'll, I can't talk today. We'll learn more about Moldova <laughs> in tomorrow's video. Thanks for joining me. Let me know how you did. Feel free to drop a comment here or on today's Wordle video, which is linked in the description below with a suggestion for a starting word for tomorrow's Wordle related to today's country. I'll answer of Moldova. And I will see you then for the next country. I'll.